Hey there, Brendan Bailey with Marine Max here in beautiful Fort Myers, Florida, and we are standing on board a lucky new owner's 325 Conquest Boston Whiter that just came in, but we wanted to walk you through it. So uh, come along for the quick walkthrough. This particular boat is powered with the V8 300 horsepower Mercury engines. Unbelievable power for this boat. Uh, just a true game changer in the Mercury lineup. Here to the starboard side, you see the awesome dive door. One of the things I always love to point out on a Boston Whiter. Look at these hinges, just overdone. Everything they do is just rigid, sturdy, and made to last. Got the flip down seat here in the, uh, in the cockpit with the port side fold down jump seat as well. Really have the ability to seat five, four or five people back here and be comfortable. And when these are all folded up, look at the amount of area you have back here to either throw up some folding teak chairs or do some fishing, whatever, uh, whatever floats your boat you can do back in this open area here. Not to mention the sure shade retractable awning that will come out over the cockpit to give you some shade back here. Uh, just a great versatile boat, whether you're cruising or, or fishing for the day. We've got the uh, Kenyan grill that pulls out here. Go to cookingwithkenyan.com. You'll see some great recipes. It's actually a legitimate electric drill that, uh, grill that actually cooks well. Lots of storage areas here. You can see the small little wet bar area here to the side with the refrigerator and the sink. Flip flop seats, uh, you've got a, a foot rest that'll pull out, but a nice seat to be able to sit on, face back, watch the dolphins chase here, or watch the wake as you go along. And then you, as you can see, just with an easy flip of the backrest, now you have the ability here to have opposing seating right next to this nice teak table uh, that will also allow this seat to slide back and give you another forward facing seat too. So again, how do you adapt the boat to how you're using it that day? Whaler's done a good job of thinking through that. Helm uh, station here, this particular boat is equipped with the dual Raymarine Axiom screens, fusion stereo system, so you got a large Mercury vessel view uh, display, and one of my favorites, the joystick docking feature uh, with Skyhook, uh, or what I like to call virtual anchor, so really keeps boating easy and simple, and uh, Whaler's done a good job of integrating that on this boat as well. So one of the things I love about this boat is look at the visibility. We have glass all the way around. This one has the half windshield to here. Um, just really gives you a nice line of sight as you are cruising or navigating or doing some fishing. You really got a nice uh, helm area here to operate the boat safely. We've prepped this boat for its new owner, but we're gonna give you a glimpse and uh, the Coast Guard kit and all the gear and stuff that comes with the boat, just to make sure that you're ready to go when you leave out of Marine Max. You'll see the U-shaped dinette here in the front where we have all the Coast Guard kit ready for the new owner to come in with the folding uh, mahogany table there. Fully featured galley with the Kenyan single burner stove, microwave oven, isotherm fridge, and then again the mid-berth, really a nice size mid-berth, really two or three people could sleep back there in there and be, uh, and be very comfortable actually. And then the uh, stand-up closet as well. And then a nice wet head with the ability to take a shower and actually has enough room for me. I'm even I'm six foot five and can pretty much stand up straight in there. So I'm Brendan Bailey with Marine Max here in beautiful Fort Myers, Florida, and we would love to hear from you. Give us a call and we'd love to get you aboard. Thanks. Bye-bye.